I'm John David Smith, and welcome once again to the Co-Mission Podcast. Last week, we established the fact that the BMA Missions Office wants to partner with our churches in the BMA of America. We want to see a movement of God as our churches reproduce themselves. In order to do that, the Missions Office must embrace the idea that we are not the center of the BMA Missions universe. Our local churches are. We are going to try and attempt to re invent ourselves here in the missions office to where we become and move away from the administration slash money distribution center to more of a clearinghouse for missions where we put emphasis on expertise, resources, and guidance in helping our churches reproduce themselves. In the architectural world, there is a saying that goes like this, that form follows function. What that means, of course, is that the questions about purpose and function must be answered before you ask the question about appearance and what is it going to look like. Well, in the missions office, we know that in the world of the BMA, our association a long time has been very clear on our mission. We know what we ought to do, but I think that you would agree with me that it's time for God to give us a new word on how, when, and where uh, what our investments are to be in His kingdom work. And so as we look at reinventing ourselves, form follows function. We need to revisit what our function is. And we believe here in the missions office that our function is to, uh, is to assist you in reproducing yourself. We want to see a God-driven church planting movement as our churches once again are able to connect to a vision of reproduction and multiplication and we see ourselves not as the ones who will carry that out but as the ones who will facilitate that. Every week here for two minutes on the Co-Mission Podcast we're going to continue to cast this vision. We want to invite you to tune in next week where we're going to continue uh, providing more segments and more steps and continuing to paint the picture of the vision that God continues to bring into focus for us. Thank you.